quarter to nine o'clock now and a beautiful start to this Saturday morning. Of course, things will be changing though. That's why I was checking with the forecast. A warm front. Well, that's what the maps are saying is happening. That's moving through, but really not going to help our temps out today. We're staying in the 50s. We do have a cold front that will quickly trail that, and that's going to increase the clouds later on. A couple of scattered showers moving through Minnesota right now, but you can see they're really not that impressive. These will be light showers that are in our forecast later on this afternoon. So enjoy what we've got right now. A lovely look from Kenosha. Lots of sunshine in your forecast to start off this morning. So we take a look at our tower cam there. I want to show you this view because it's so pretty. Lots of blue. Don't be blinded by the light. Put the uh, sunglasses on as well as the scarf because temps are in the 30s this morning. We are going to warm up, like I said, into the 50s, but that's cooler than we're supposed to be. 53 degrees for our highs. So let's time out the rain for you. Big storm system kind of cutting off the moisture from us. So that means any of these rain showers that develop this afternoon will be relatively light in nature. The heaviest rain will be to our north. This swings through overnight and then the skies start to clear. That will actually drop our temps down to the freezing mark for many of us. So frost definitely a, going to be a widespread thing overnight tonight. Certainly crisp and cool and clear to start off your Sunday morning. So we'll see sun to start. But then like today, we watch the cloud cover increase and yet another for, er, cold front swings through. That'll spark off some more showers. Very light in nature. You want to have the umbrella though or the rain gear, especially if you're headed up to Lambeau, have the poncho ready for that. Behind it, colder air just spills on in. We're talking 40s for highs in our forecast. It is going to be chilly for next week and early next week as we continue to get these shots of cold air. Going to be looking at snow showers even in portions of northern Minnesota, even north of I-94 in Minnesota as it gets into Wisconsin and hits some slightly warmer air. So a little bit of a rain snow mix through the section middle section of the state. For us, I think it'll just bring some light rain showers into our forecast. Can't rule an isolated snowflake though in some of our northern and western counties. And speaking of that S word, actually, you know what? We are getting closer to that average first trace of snow, which is October 28th. We've already surpassed the earliest trace of snow. If you want to go for the record, December 5th. That's the latest first trace of snow. So anti-snow lovers, just hope for December. For us though today, light rain showers in the forecast. Later this afternoon, 52 for your high in Waukesha, a bit breezy by the end of the afternoon. Then those winds calm down overnight as the skies clear, and that means frost. Certainly a definite possibility. Frost advisory for all of southeastern Wisconsin because temps even at the lake around 36 degrees, 32 for your overnight low in Waukesha with clear skies. And tomorrow starting off dry, ending with light rain showers again in the forecast. 55 for a high, then 40s all night next week. Next chance for rain comes in on Wednesday night and into Thursday. The rest of your 10 day outlook shows 50s returning for next weekend. Here's Daybreak Sports.